Hi, this is Matt with AppliancePartsPros.com. Today we'll be showing you how to repair your appliance. Remember, anytime you work on an appliance, make sure it's unplugged or the circuit breakers are off so there's no chance of electrocution. In this video, we'll show you how to change out the Frigidaire refrigerator door hinge. It's going to be a very easy repair and it'll only take a few minutes to show you how to do it. If you already have one of these, great. If not, you can click on the link below or get at AppliancePartsPros.com. When you open up the package, you're going to get the new refrigerator door hinge. The refrigerator door hinge is the upper hinge for the refrigerator door. The manager should be changing it out so if it's damaged and the door is not opening and closing properly. The refrigerator door hinge is located at the top of the refrigerator door. Before we take it off, we're going to put some tape on here to make sure the door doesn't fall off when we take the hinge off. You want to make sure you use some non-residue tape. Once it's taped down, we can go up top and take the hinge off. We're going to use a Phillips screwdriver to take out the screws that hold the hinge cover on. Once you have the screws out, you can lift the cover off and just set it aside. Once you have the cover out of the way, we have to take out these two bolts that hold the hinge to the fridge. We're going to use a ratchet with the 3-inch socket to take them out. If you have it loosened up, you can just turn it by hand. Once you have the bolts off, you can lift the refrigerator door hinge off and pull it off the door. Here's the old refrigerator door hinge next to the new one. If you already have one of these, great. If not, you can get it at AppliancePartsPros.com. To put the new door hinge in, you just want to line up the pin with the door and set it in place. And then if your door dropped down in the middle, the holes won't line up, so you're going to have to pull the whole door over. Once you get it lined up, you can put the bolts back in. We're going to run them in with our hand. They're not going to be that tight. If yours is tight, you can grab the ratchet to help tighten them down. Once you have it snug, we're going to grab the 3 inch socket with the ratchet and tighten it down so it's nice and tight. Then we can put the hinge cover back on. All you have to do is lift it up, set it into place, make sure the screw holes are all lined up. And then you want to make sure that on this hole here, where the screw goes down into the hinge, that you use the little machine screw. Once you have the screws in, we can take the tape off the door. Once you have it off, you can plug it back in and take it for a spin. Thanks for joining us for another successful repair brought to you by AppliancePartsPros.com. Check out our other repair videos on our site, Facebook, and YouTube.